Hello guys, this is Anastasia. Recently I showed you this bubbles design and I know that not every white gel will work for this technique and just in case you don't have the white gel that will work, today I will show you a different way to do this design and you can use any color for the background. Let's begin. For abstract water design I will apply background first and you can use any gel gel polish or even acrylic just make sure that you have a contrast background and the main color apply it and cure in led for one minute then we will need a builder gel and i recommend to find the thickest gel that you have i'm using entity one and also apex builder nsi will work after curing the background and without taking off the sticky layer, I'm applying a thin layer of the builder gel. And it's very tricky. Do not apply too much or we will not end up with a good result. And also try to make it as even as possible. And then we will start doing the same. But with the builder gel, these bubbles, they will move around a little. So do not forget to take small spaces between them and also apply them always in different sizes like one is big one is small then a medium one if they all will be too perfect and symmetrical it, it won't look as nice and continue applying as you can see, they're already moving and getting closer to each other, so it's okay if you leave some distance between them. Eventually, they will move closer. I'm using the small brush, number zero, synthetic. Okay, and when we are done with the one color, then we can do the same with the other one and I will start from this corner so the goal for this design is to choose a really nice matching colors to have a contrast background and just to find a nice pattern for the bubbles so you don't have to repeat this design like bubble to bubble but try to make it look really contrast and also the goal is to match colors now we can wait a few seconds until they will move around and become wider and also we will have this fade on the borders and then cure it in led for one minute also if you have some excess gel on the sides you can take a clean brush and carefully take it off and this is the final result. I applied top coat and sealed it. So the advantage of this method is that you can use any color for background and also it works with the most builder gels. If you will take thin consistency gel, it will be harder to work. So you will need to work very fast. You need to apply these dots right away and cure it. With thicker consistency, you will have a little bit more time. If you don't have gel, you have only gel polishes, then you can also take a thick consistency base coat and do the same. If you missed the first part of this tutorial, I will leave the link in the description box and you also can get inspired by the beautiful works from my students after that video. Thank you so much for watching. If this is your first time on my channel, consider subscribing as I post nail art tutorials every week. See you in my next video. Goodbye.